Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Cyber Security Podcast. I am Shreya and today we are going to explore the world of advanced penetration testing, a crucial skill set for the ever evolving cyber security landscape. And to break it all down, we have an expert, Ashish from Infosec Train, an APT expert. So let's welcome him. Welcome Ashish to the show. Thank you Shreya, thank you for inviting me. So let's just uh, jump right in and I would like to ask what makes this APT training from InfoSec Train stand out? And along with that, I would ask what are the top five reasons why should any professional pursue this training with InfoSec Train? So uh, before uh, giving you five reasons why to opt for InfoSec uh, Train's APT training, let me just uh, tell a brief about APT. So APT stands for uh, Advanced Penetration Testing and that's a certification based training. But if we talk about our training, it gives you the insights about the advanced level of penetration testing. Mm -hmm. And uh, I would like to tell my audience that this training is not for the beginners. This is not an entry level training. This is for the people who are aiming for OSCP based certification mm -hmm. and who are uh, trying to learn more into the network side pen testing and advanced web application pen testing. Now, uh, let's move on to the reasons that what are the five reasons why we should opt. So the very first reason is uh, that as being a pen tester, we have uh, done pen testings worldwide. Mm -hmm. So we have real world case studies, we have real world scenarios which we use in our examples. Mm -hmm. So that's the first reason. And then uh, like if you want to learn advanced exploitation techniques like buffer overflow, how to do lateral movement, these kinds of techniques, then you should opt for uh, InfoSec Train's APD program. And apart from that, uh, we also provide customized learning. So if we talk about customized learning, so if let's say someone wants to add some more topics to the prepared course content, so we can do that. So we are open to that also. And we provide uh, support, uh, like after training support also, if someone wants uh, help in some projects and if someone wants some ideas, uh, so that's why uh, someone should opt for uh, this training. So and uh, the last is uh, hands-on lab. So we provide uh, like hands-on lab. So this course is around 80% hands-on. So you get 100% practical knowledge and uh, less theoretical knowledge. So because practical is more important in the pen testing side. So these are the five reasons why you should opt for uh, the InfoSec Trains APT training program. That's very interesting and very correct. So moving forward, so let's talk about the training uh, significance. Why mastering pen testing techniques so crucial for today's cybersecurity landscape? So uh, if you talk about pen testing and this APT training, so it helps you to uh, mitigate vulnerabilities proactively. Mm -hmm. So when we talk about the vulnerabilities and nowadays architecture of the organization, it's it has become complex. It's not like old days. So now if you want to find out the vulnerabilities, you should have the advanced skills to penetrate inside the network and find out the vulnerabilities and exploit the vulnerabilities. If you find out the vulnerabilities, then you will be able to mitigate them easily. Then you, you stay ahead of the attackers and you get the attacker's mindset. What are attacker is thinking, what skills attacker is using and what are the things, what tools attacker is using. So you get insights into that as well. And if you are able to find out those vulnerabilities and mitigate them, so you are ahead of the attacker. So that's why that's uh, this training and this course is essential for a security professional. Okay, that's very interesting. You always have to think about how to stay ahead of the threat. Yes, okay, that's nice. So now let's talk about some tools and techniques. What uh, tools any professional should master for this APT? So in APT training, we cover lots of tools, like uh, we have 50 plus tools that we cover, but some of the most critical tools that we need to cover, first is Metasploit framework, which helps you to find out the exploits and exploit the vulnerabilities, gather more information about the target network and target devices. Then we have Empire framework, which is a command and control framework, which helps you to create a bi-directional channel between the target machine and the attacker's machine so that you can upload more malwares into the system. Then we have uh, Mimic Ads, which is now named as Kiwi. It helps you to gather more information, find out the passwords from the system. Then uh, we also have uh, Covenant C2. That's also a command and control framework, which will, which will uh, again uh, start a bi-directional channel between the systems. So these are some of the tools that uh, a penetration tester should know. For, and in APT training, we cover all these tools. That's very, very nice actually. So how does this training uh, helps in the career advancement and any professionals who are thinking about the transition into this industry? 
So uh, if we talk about advanced penetration testing, as I said, it is a advanced course. It tells mm-hmm. you about as advanced exploits and advanced tools. So it helps you in uh, getting the knowledge that uh, a professional, a security professional should have, and a penetration tester basically should have. And the job rules that you get after uh, completing this training, you can apply for red teamer, penetration tester, cyber security consultant. You can be a cyber security architect. So these kinds of job roles you can apply for. Based on the level of experience and the skills. Okay, science sounds very interesting and exquisite. So that's nice. So as we are about to wrap up this podcast, what final piece of advice would you like to give to the professionals who are thinking about pursuing this APT training? Uh, so I would like to uh, advise personals or the security professionals. So uh, those who are entry level, don't go for directly advanced penetration testing training as it is an advanced training. The prerequisites for this training, you should have a good amount of knowledge of Linux. You should have a good amount of knowledge for Python. And also you should know the exploitation basics, how Nmap works, how Metasploit framework works, and how you should, how you do the basic exploits, how you find out the exploits from the internet, use them for exploiting the basic vulnerabilities. Then you should come for this. And also I would like to advise the uh, professionals to go for uh, practical based uh, training and practical based learning because practical is most, more important in terms of pen testing as you uh, talk about pen testing side. So for pen tester, you should have a practical knowledge more than theoretical knowledge. So these are uh, some of the advice I want to give to my audience. Thank you so much for the expert insights, Ashish. And to our listeners who are thinking about advancing their penetration testing skills, do check out InfoSec Train's APT training and level up in your career. See you in the next episode. Until then, good day. Bye-bye.